And what exactly is Nachtalb? How can the experience be described? First, the rendered sphere is viewed from outside. The sphere consists of a swarm of particles pulsating at the user's main frequency. Additionally, an impulse sound is perceptible, which is synchronous to this frequency. If the user moves into the sphere, the impulse sound becomes clear. Furthermore, the tact suit starts to emit a vibration impulse, which is also synchronized with the main brain frequency. The active decision to engage with one's own brain activity is rewarded with the overall experience, immersion inside the translation of one's neurological processes, to which, in turn, the inputs to tactile, auditory, and visual senses are coupled. The main senses are now synchronized by their input. In concept, we are making use of a phenomenon called brainwave entrainment. Non-invasive rhythmic stimulation can affect the frequency of brainwaves. It can be observed that auditory, visual or tactile rhythmic stimulation at a certain frequency correlates with the parallel measured frequency of the brainwaves. And that is how the feedback loop of Nachtalb is closed. Nachtalb turns brain activity from data input into sensory input, which then directly influences the brain activity data input again. This means that combining brain-computer interfaces and virtual reality enables the user's brain to interact with itself on a more and more immersive dimension.